Yeah, hello guys. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I greet you according to the time you are listening to my voice, guys. I'm always busy, so I just want to be taking a quick one because I don't want the time to pass. I didn't make any video. Today, guys, I'll be teaching you how to control genes. Yes, as in how to control genes. You no, know, there's what you guys need to know. Okay, God created mankind, right? And He gave us brain. God created genes and He gave them supernatural power. Now, human being has the brain to think. The gene has not have the brain to think, but they have the supernatural power. And the brain God gave to us, we are only using two, two, three, four, highest five percent of it. Imagine using hundred percent of your brain. Now, I will tell you guys my own encounter, my own experience. Now, with this, that we have the power to think, the brain God created man in His own image. Now, God created the angels from the light, right? And God created the uh, market from the clay, from the clay. The God created dreams from smokeless fire. I come, the angels are we are created from the light. The dreams, the genes, they were created from the uh, smokeless fire. Why human beings was we are, we are human beings were created from the from the from the clay from the sand? Okay, now. The agent were created from light. That's why it is difficult for you to see. If agent should come in normal form to you, the light coming from there can make you blind. That's why it's hard for agent to come direct as normal agent to you. Agent don't have male or female. So they come in any form to talk to you, like in a human form or whatever. You understand? Because they should come as they are, the way they are as light, you will get blind. Then the gene, and now in this earth, we are not the only being living on earth. It's human beings are the genes that live on this earth. Yes, you are not the only one living on earth. It is human beings are the genes that live on earth. Okay? Now, human beings has the brain to think, but they think they don't have the supernatural power. Then, a gene has the supernatural power, but they don't have the brain. That is why you see one malam, you see one native daughter or whatever, controlling thousands of genes that of genes to do what he want them to do for you what you guys have to know is that this physical brain before it happens it's physical it has happened spiritually yes now you the brain you have i would now let me give you guys my own encounter i will try to like increase my brain power there was a day i was trying working on such i was try to go into full meditation like clear my mind for hours Without thinking, talking to anybody, I was not asleep. I was feeling something like sparks on my head, like as in I was feeling spark on my head. Like I saw myself, I saw myself in a different place. I don't even know when. I, I don't know if it was scared or it was shock or I opened my eye. So human be. Now back to the topic. Today's topic is how human be control genes. As I've said earlier, human brain has the brain to think. But they think they don't have the supernatural power, right? But the brain, uh, the, uh, the gene, they, they don't have the brain to think, but they have the supernatural power. And uh, where are genes found? Genes are found in the toilet, the leaves in the toilet, and uh, the leaves in the, the leaves in, uh, the, the leaves in the waste bin. You see, that's where waste bin. No matter one, you don't follow waste bin at night. They live in waste bin, they live in the toilet. And uh, the genes are, they are the type that they can see us, but you as a normal human being, you cannot see them because there's a vein covering our eye. And the reason why God used that vein to cover mankind eye, because if you should see them out of shock, you can die or you can faint or you can cause you something. When you see them out of shock, you will die. So that's why they are the ones seeing us. We can't see them. So if they are coming, you are coming. They are the ones to see you and they will leave the road for you. They will give you space for you to pass. You see how God are place mark kind above all so now that is now they they don't have that power to think for themselves that's why you see many human beings like the malams or some pastor or whatever little daughter controlling genes and now how do they control gym they trick genes with what they know that the genes will like now one thing that you see normally that they say gene uh, possess human being gene there's difference between gene and the uh, demons right genes possess human being and uh, you no know, see somebody like especially the north is common you see one girl will just be shouting in the running to those bees just be shouting whatever genes possess human being the reason why genes possess human beings is that once they possess human being they enjoy what that human being is enjoying like they possess you the food you eat as you are enjoying it they are enjoying it you drink as they are, as you are enjoying it they are enjoying it 
you get you have sex as you are enjoying it you have enjoying it so that is why most time you see gene possessing human being so with the knowledge of this in basic there are some things that i would have loved to talk about but something is telling me people will abuse it it is this in basic that is why gene uh, the malas and they will now use what they want like to control the genes like telling the gene that do this for me i'll give you a cock and that cock you are giving the gene that blood is like eating that meat for them and they don't have the brain to think i know one that one that my dad told me that uh, they were building a bridge and there was a there as a, there was a there was there was a spirit that was disturbing that was disturbing them there that was they are facing it the thing will happen so they were looking for help so when they came this man um uh, go inside Talk to the spirit and say that I, I came to challenge you. I will enter inside this bottle and come out. At least you can enter this bottle and come out with a coke bottle. He entered inside the bottle, he came out. He has, he has if he can do it. He uh, the priest was trying to prove this. He said, This is a simple challenge, nothing else. Let's do this. This I'm yours. She did it and he quickly used the cover, cover it, lock it. And now, what am I bringing this? Any place the breeze cannot enter, spirit cannot enter there. Don't just stick uh, uh, the spirit uh, penetrate wall anytime. No, 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 no. They follow breeze, breeze. Uh, they follow breeze. They cannot just penetrate. They follow breeze. So if breeze cannot go there, spirit cannot go inside there. How do you spirit? If if a spirit is in a place and you maybe like in a container, you lock that container. There's no way that spirit can be able to come out from that container again. But you open that container because there's no breeze for it to use to come out. So that's the weak point. <laughs> guys, I'm on the road, but I just wish to do this video for you guys. So, do you guys want me to do part two of this particular video? Let me know. Let's go in detail. Let me review secret to you. I still remain your friend, the seer, the, the, the small boy you know. <laughs> See you guys in the next video. <laughs>